Hey YouTube, hi internet. This is Joe over at Delray Customs. Uh, gonna show you the procedures or which wire needs to go where on these best bypasses. These best bypasses are a four wire universal. They will either work with the Alpines or Kenwoods, Pioneers, Jensen's, Clarions that have one wire. But it usually comes in this type of packaging with a green, yellow, blue, and black wire. I here have an old Alpine AV harness that happens to have the yellow black and yellow blue wires coming out of it. One is a parking brake and the other is a foot brake. Blue is gonna be the remote and black is ground. So two wires that you might be sharing on this harness are gonna be the black ground coming out of the bypass so that you're going to join up with the ground that's on your harness. The blue wire is going to be the remote that's going to energize it and tell it when to turn on. You might have this blue wire already hooked up to like your uh, amplifiers or other accessories that are turning on along with the radio. But these are going to be the two major wires that people tend to have a lot of confusion with. The green wire is always going to be the parking brake wire. That's going to be the one that sends a solid ground output. And that's going to be yellow blue on Alpine head units. The yellow wire is going to be the foot brake, which sends out a 12 volt pulse. And that's going to be a yellow black wire on Alpines. So yellow to yellow black, green to yellow blue, black to ground, and blue to remote. That's what tells it to turn on when it needs to. Thanks, YouTube.